Deuteronomy 13:7a. Ki yesitcha achicha ven imecha o vincha o bitcha o eshet chekecha o reacha asher kenafshcha baseter lemor. Now we only have half of the verse here, and I want to do a video uh, for the next day on kind of some of the accents here. But let's let's look at how this breaks down. We begin here with another if. We get another conditional, and the idea here is we're we're talking about your brother, the son of your mother, or your son, or your daughter, or the wife of your bosom. This would be understood to be the wife that you embrace, or your friend, and this is your friend whom is, verbless clause here, who is as your soul. So it would be a very close friend is the idea here. And that's who we're talking about. Okay, so I've, I've stopped there for a reason. That's who we're talking about. This whole thing is the noun phrase or the subject phrase that we would think about as related to this verb, yesitcha. And so the verb that we have here is samik vav tav. And this is a hifil of the verb, hifil, hifil imperfect. This is a third masculine singular with that yod preformative. And then we get the 2ms pronominal suffix. And the verb means to uh, entice or to mislead, to incite. So let's go back and pick all of this up. If any of these people, any of these people, and remember, key oftentimes uh, can be conditional if it's not the Lord who is acting. So here, clearly not the Lord. These would be all sorts of other people. We don't know for certainly whether this will come about. So conditional. If any of these people that we've just referred to here, if any of these people incite you or entice you, and that's the main verbal clause. Next, we're going to get down here at the bottom. If you jump all the way down here to the bottom past all of the midpoint noun phrase, uh, then we get this in secret or in the hiddenness saying, and that's going to introduce then the direct speech in the next part of the video. So a little bit difficult syntactically there. We've got to get through all of these people who might do this before we get to the rest of the verse.